So we can use a classic trick on this problem because there are variables in the question right there. We got k and variables in all of the answer options. And when that's the case, we can just make up our own numbers. So from now on, let's just say that k equals 10. Totally allowed, I promise. And all of a sudden, if we plug in 10 wherever we see k, this problem becomes a lot easier. So let's take a look at it. A fruit drink contains 20 grams of water, 5 grams of sugar, and 10 grams of fruit syrup. What percent is fruit syrup? Well, if there are 10 grams of fruit syrup out of a total of 20 plus 5 plus 10, 35, that comes out to about, you can use your calculator for this, about 29%. And so all we have to do now is plug 10 in wherever we see K in the answer options, and whichever answer option gives us 29, well, that's the winner. So let's get to it. If you use your calculator, you can plug it in here. 100 times 10, that's 1,000 over 10 minus 25. Oh, well, that's going to be a negative number. Comes out to about negative 67, so that's not right. 25 plus 10, that's 35 over 100. Well, that's 0.35. No, thank you. 25 plus 10, that's 35 over 100 times 10, 1,000, so 0 0.035. No dice. And then 10 over 100 is 0 0.1. All hope seems lost until we get to this final answer here. We got 100 times 10 divided by 35. And when you plug that in, would you look at that? It comes out to about 29. And for that reason, E is the correct answer.